Praise the Lord Church. Today's Bible meditation is taken from Ezekiel chapters 42 and 43, Proverbs chapter 10 and Luke chapter 20. If you're new to Living God family, a very warm welcome to you in Jesus' name. Hope this video will be a blessing to you as you hear and listen to the thoughts as we read through the Bible together. I encourage you to read the chapters during your personal devotion time and become recipients of listening to God's voice daily. Ezekiel chapter 42 verse 13 Then he said to me, The north chambers and the south chambers, which are opposite the separating courtyard, are the holy chambers where the priests who approach the Lord shall eat the most holy offerings. There they shall lay the most holy offerings, the grain offering, the sin offering, and the trespass offering, for the place is holy. Ezekiel chapter 43 verse 27 When these days are over, it shall be, on the eighth day and thereafter that the priest shall offer your burnt offerings and your peace offerings on the altar and i will accept you says the lord god proverbs chapter 10 verse 29 the way of the lord is strength for the upright but destruction will come to the workers of iniquity luke chapter 20 verse 47 who devour widows houses and for a pretense make long prayers these will receive greater condemnation. God the Almighty, our Heavenly Father, looks into the heart. The temple details were given to the Israelites to be built to overcome sin and enter into the holy presence of God to draw strength from the Lord. God our Heavenly Father grieves when His creation is lost in sin and also pretend to be pious. A heart not connected to God is worth nothing. When we accept Christ, we become connected to God Almighty and His Holy Spirit comes and dwells inside of us, nudging our hearts, putting boundaries for us to behave and be at our best conduct. So today may we experience God's holy presence and guidance in our lives and be strengthened physically, emotionally and above all spiritually. Thanks be to God for the gift of salvation. Praise be to our one working God. In Jesus' name, Amen. Thank you for the privilege of your time in watching the videos and being part of Living God community. God bless you all abundantly as we are all created to be holy and happy in Christ Jesus. Amen.